Alright, so we are parked in Calgary getting ready for a pizza. So, we're trying out a juice that was given to us and some other food. What is that place, babe? It's called Shawarma House. What is that? Uh, Shawarma House is a Mediterranean food place that we decided to check out and the guy was very nice and he gave us a free mango juice and free baklava but we'll try the baklava later. Yeah. Jude's gonna try the mango. Juice. While we are waiting. Oh wow. That is real juice. So the interesting part is that what I don't still get it like they served the environment and they put uh, paper straws mm -hmm. And they gave us plastic cups. Right, but at least it's, it's a great way to save the world. It says made from renewable resources. So after that, you cannot renew this one. Mm -hmm. It's the last time. So it's still a waste. But at least it's a good start for saving the environment. Do you want to try this? Yes, I do. Wow, that's so it is really like, that's mango juice. So in the US, I don't know the whole state, but in California, we juice is about fake, right? Or it's with a lot of water or sugar. This is so good. Can you hold this one, see? Yes, of course. Can use the tools. So, yeah, and we have few food. And we Waiting gotta, in the back for us. Yeah, get some alcohol yeah. and Head back to the hotel, try it out, and tomorrow we have a nice adventure planned. Yes, we do. Relentlessly original. Awesome. So we are in a liquor store. Gonna try out some local liquor. Don't know which one, but it's pretty big, so hopefully we get something okay. nice, local, something oh, like that. There we go. Oh, uh, yeah. Hi. Canadian is there. Somebody said hi, right? Yeah, so I said hello back. Okay. I don't know where they are. So, I was reading an article. Calgary alone has 13 to 15 whiskey distilleries. Oh, the guys there. <laughs> Alright, so somebody said hey for us. We didn't realize that. So, what we're gonna see is we're gonna try hard liquor. This is These wine. are the wines, but nice to see that yeah. they have their own course. Makes sense. Yep, so what. Uh, um, sorry. No, it's okay. It's a gin and tequila. Yeah, I that's not weird. I'm interested in that. Oh, okay. Calgary vodka. Nah. That's interesting. Thank you. What's in Google says what's the most famous one? These ones. Oh, wait. These are local ones. Okay, so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna search for one and then you're gonna see it when we're trying it. Yes. Sounds good? Yes. He saw the beer and alcohol place. So, again, we're in Calgary and then we are trying this called Abeltra Premium Canadian Rye Whiskey. It's 40% alcohol level, 375. We bought the small one because we only staying here for four days. Uh, and we had to drive, so we're gonna first try that, then we do have food with us. It's with neat, not neat, sorry, with rocks. Sorry. Oh nice. It's very basic. Right? I'm not a big whiskey drinker, but this one felt tolerable, like I can drink it in it. I good. have tried like I don't know maybe 40 50 whiskeys hmm. this is so like very basic okay before you guys make any judgments we did ask people yes. in the alcohol store it's called ACE alcohol mm -hmm. you will see in the video and they recommended us this so we tried to google it and we couldn't find one of the best ones so maybe next time we do find it mm -hmm. All right, so, and she's gonna explain about this food. Yes. So one of the food places we visited is Sharma House. And so Sharma House is a Mediterranean food place. Um, and the person um, recommended the doner, which is a beef meat with a special spice seasoning in it. And it's cooked in a cone shape for better like heating and cooking throughout the meat. Um, it's a collection of thin strips of beef. So it's gonna be really, really good. And I filmed a bit of how like 
it was all piled up and he rolled it up amazingly. So I don't know how he fit it all in there, but he did. And we're excited to eat it. On the side, he also provided some mango juice that we um, drank as well and we showed you in the car and then some baklava. Um, I did ask for the all their spicy sauces on the side, um, just in case um, we don't like it or it doesn't feel good for us. So this is how big it is. You can see it almost the size of my head. They have a lot of, I don't want to open it yeah. so the fun is gone, but you yeah. can see all the stuff He's in it. It's like a kebab. In a pita roll. Yeah, so we're gonna try this one. Mm -hmm. So good. Very good, mm. okay. Great, and then after our first few bites, we can try with some sauces if you want. Mm. Um, the flavors are amazing. Yeah. So yeah. far, one of the good ones we had in Canada. Mm. Comparing to Vancouver, you can check out our videos for that. You like it, right? Mm hmm. Let's get yep. the sauces. It's not a sauce. This is what is this? Oh, it's the free baklava. It's a dessert they, they make. So let's, I'm gonna try that one. It's like a pastry. Mm. Like it? Yeah, so sweet and nice. Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Okay. So we're gonna try the sauce. So we have two. Mm -hmm. What are these? This is hot and spicy. And this is, I think, their regular like cream sauce. Okay. Don't you have the cream sauce already in? I think so. Yeah, they just gave it extra on the side. No, we don't have that in. Oh. That's so it's like a different. Whipped, it's like yeah. a whipped butter. Yeah. That's so tasty. Good. Okay, let's see. Just gonna take that. Gonna put it in here. Just like this. It's it's like frothy. Mmm. Just like it? Okay, good. This is so good. A unique thing is I never had these kind of things sweet. This is so sweet. Um, oh man, just eat the sauce without the thing, honey. It, it tastes so good. It's almost like a whipped cream. Oh, it's so good. All right, so we're gonna try out our next one right after this bite. Great. Okay, so this <clears throat> is tacos. I know, but I, we just want to try out tacos in Canada. Right. So you always eat tacos in Mac well, not Mexico, like California. Mm -hmm. So she's going to talk about it. She has a lot of information for that. Yeah, so we picked up a few tacos from um, Native Tongue which is a taco shop, obviously. But what's really neat about this store is that every Sunday they feature a new recipe from Mexico. And so um, basically for the month of June, so all the meat recipes or fish recipes are from um, the Gulf of Mexico. And so each month they actually cycle through the recipes, which is really cool. Yeah. And so this taco shop has won um, best food and drink in Calgary for three years in a row. And it's only seven years old, so they made it through the pandemic. Um, they were here before that, and now they're still thriving. When I went into the shop, it was quite full. Dude's taking pictures that we can add them to our Yelp reviews later. I mean, so this looks is so good. Yeah, so that is actually a fried red snapper taco. So fried red snapper snapper taco. Mm. So I just took it out. <clears throat> this is how it looks like. Lift it up a little more. Yeah, and you can see the cheese on sauce. it. What is this one? A sauce with um, beer battered red snapper and a little lime. And so Jude's putting the lime on it. There it is. So. And you want to go for the first bite? Oh, no, you can. You know what we always say, huh? Gentlemen, 
Who goes first? The ladies. Mm -hmm. Mom. Do you like it? I do like it. We ordered these first. So I wish they were a little warmer, but it's good. I think it has a really nice balance of flavors. Mm. I almost want the beer batter part to be a little stronger. Mm. I don't know, but but I do like it. It is good. It's a good fish taco, but what do you think? I like all the flavors in it. Yeah. It's not too much. It's not too bad. Mm. It's not too spicy. Mm -hmm. It's all medium. I like the sauces comparing to Mex uh, tacos that we eat in California. I mean, it, it's good. There's a nice moist. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe it's because of the it took it some time to eat, but still, it holds its okay. quality. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like it. Mm -hmm. Now, okay. I'm gonna try this unique piece. Yeah, they didn't label the names of the tacos. They did. Oh, yeah, but I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Chicken? I think this one's chicken. Let's pick it out. That's how it looks like in the box. Yeah, these tacos are pretty small, but it's nice you can order them uh, like a la carte, like what we did, and they're about $250 to $350 each, depending. I think this is chicken. So, yeah, he's adding the lime on it. Oh, uh, <clears throat> how much was this one? The total cost for this one? Um, $26 in Canadian. Canadian. And four. we have like one, two, three, four, five. Five tacos. Five. Yeah. Smells good. It smells good. Right. Oh, you go mm -hmm. Is it chicken? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. Charred boiled. Or charred grilled chicken. Soft on the inside, but mm -hmm. just hard on the top. I like it. To make it more unique taste, you can see this. So good. I'm going to try it without the... Tortilla. Mm -hmm. oh it might be God. better without the tortilla. You don't yeah. need the tortilla. You should just order it as a, as a side, like a meat side. Really? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think you can. Because try this without... Without the thing. Mmm, so soft, yeah. So good, right? You don't need a tortilla for that. Uh, cool. Ready mm. to finish that. Okay, one of these is pork belly. I need to figure out which one, though. Oh, that's carnitas, I think. So, you can see how it's put together. So you don't pay for this. What you pay for is what's inside oh. it. So let's see. It's so oilish. You can see that. I don't know. Oh my god. Is it pineapple? No. No. I don't know. But it's good? But it's good. Okay. okay let me get you a napkin. All right. Mmm. The taste of the meat. Is there? It's like I amazing. It's carnitas. That's what we just so pork. Yeah, I like that. It's like a. That's really good. That is really good. Yeah. Good job, Canada. No. The food is good, even though it's customly made. Not for us, I mean for Canadians, because <laughs> we can't normally eat spicy food like Americans and stuff like that. Yeah. The American culture is so diverse, mm -hmm. which is amazing. Okay, this is something. something. We'll have to figure out when we yeah. write it. They didn't put the names and we don't know. So it looks pretty nice. Not bad. I liked it. So far, one that's the lowest. Belly? Yeah. 
the mine and the pork belly, then the meat is really sweet, mm. but I feel like there wasn't enough on top of it. Oh, and this is chicken. Okay, so this is a chicken. It's a chicken verde. Yeah. The reason these are breaking is because we kept it when it was hot. Right. Yeah, this is after we're eating about after one hour. Mm. Mm. You can never go wrong mm. with the salsa there, like with a green sauce. You can never go wrong with that. Oh. Do you like it? The last two was like okay. Mm -hmm. well, the first three was amazing. Yeah. I'm loving the taste, the, the moist. Oh. I wish it doesn't come with the bread or what do you call that? The tortilla? Tortillas. Yeah, I bet, I, I'm sure there's a way you can order meals without it being a taco. It can be like yeah. a combo or whatever, but it's, it's all pretty good. good. Yeah. All right. We have one more thing, but we're going to eat that later. So we'll record it later. Mm -hmm. Until then. We'll enjoy this. And we're going to enjoy that and then enjoy the alcohol. See you guys later. We decided to go ahead and try piece or a slice of a pizza. Mm -hmm. This is how it looks like. She's going to give you the introduction. Yeah, so we picked up pizza from Una Pizza, which is, they have two locations. And the location we went to is the one in downtown off 17th Street. And we ordered the Cuatro Carne, which just means four meats. And now Judy's going to try it. Uh, I'm going to try it. Mm. Very um, light and airy, actually. Mm. Ham, bacon, pepperoni, and mm. sausage. Well, the four meats. So this one was twenty-seven dollars. Canadian dollars. Canadian. Was it worth it? No. No, I've had better pizza. Yeah, we had better pizza for that. Cheaper than that. No. But no. it has a nice taste. Mm -hmm. I mean, pizza is known for Italy or. Uh, New York, right? Mm -hmm. Chicago. So Chicago, wow, it's amazing. We will do it. Hold on, we're gonna see that, yeah. So, yeah, that's all for today. Food. We're gonna try out more new th places tomorrow, and day after, and day after, day after, day after. Mhm. Mm yeah. Thank you for watching. If you guys like, hit the like button, subscribe. That help us a lot. So please do it right now yes i'm waiting did you click on it no come on go ahead do it you're making me hungry look at this all right then if you did thank you so much if you don't thank you again for watching anyway see you next time